The LAMP stack is a collection of open source software that is put together on a server to allow it to run dynamic websites and web apps written in PHP. This is an acronym for the Linux operating system, which is used in conjunction with the Apache web server. The backend data is stored in a MySQL database, while PHP handles the dynamic processing. A MySQL database server is generally used as the backend in a LAMP stack. And MariaDB is the latest and drop-in alternative for the classic MySQL server. This tutorial will show you how to set up a LAMP stack on a rocky Linux 8 server, with MariaDB serving as the database management system in brief. You need to have root access to your rocky Linux server to do this tutorial. Step 1. First, you need to update the system. The DNF is the default package manager in Rocky Linux 8. The yum package manager is also included. Both the package managers use similar commands and you can use both similarly. You can use Y option with the installation command to continue the installation process with default configurations and options. The Y option passes the yes value for all the interactions while installation. You can use the installation command without Y option but then you need to confirm every interaction query while the installation. Remy repository provides you the latest versions of the software. To use the Remy repository, you need to install the Apple install repository first, and then the Remy repository. You can find the URL for the installation of the Remy repository in the description below.
Step 2. Install Apache Web Server. The Apache server package name is HTTPD, and service name is also HTTPD. After installing the Apache web server, you must make the web server auto start at system reboots. You can use the enable option for that. And to start the service now, you can use now option in one command for ease of use. Of course you can use it as two commands, systemctl enable HTTPD and systemctl start HTTPD. You can use the status option to check the current status of the service. Then you must allow access to the web service for outside connections through the server firewall. And you have to reload the firewall to take the effect. The service name of the firewall is firewall. Also, you can allow the port 80 TCP from the firewall for the same purpose. If you wish to use HTTPS with your website, you can allow HTTPS service or port 443 TCP from the firewall. For example, you can add the HTTPD port to firewalled using firewall CMD permanent add port equals 80 TCP. Now check the web server. You can see the test page of the web server entering the IP address of your server in the address bar of the web browser. Since I am using the same machine to access the web server, I am using the localhost address. Step 3. Install PHP 8. You can view the list of the PHP versions available for the installation. I am installing PHP version PHP MySQL ND module is needed to connect your web applications to MySQL or MariaDB database server. After PHP installation you should restart the Apache web server to take effect. I am going to check the installed PHP and its modules by calling PHP information in a PHP file. And it can be viewed using the web browser.
Step 4. MariaDB Database Server and Client Installation. I am installing default MariaDB version given by the Rocky Linux. MariaDB also needs to enable to load automatically on reboot and start now. You can use MySQL secure installation command to securely set up the MariaDB installation. Keep in mind to use a strong and hard to guess password for the root user. The default option is capitalized, and you can just press the enter button to confirm the default value. And that's all for the video. We shall meet in the next video on installing PHPMyAdmin and configure the WordPress website on Rocky Linux. Thank you.